Welcome, Hellions, to the vlog. A um, couple different things happened today. One of which was... <laughs> I'm so upset right now, okay? I'll just say it, that this is what I have on the video camera. Whatever happened to all the other footage, this is all I have. And I just got through recording these two things. This is COC and the Facebook question of the day. Uh, so I'll just tell you what happened today. Unfortunately, we don't have a Burger King update of the day, although I did film that this morning. Uh, we also don't have the clip of my boss and I going to lunch today. And we don't have the clip of me after lunch saying, Hey guys, this is where we had lunch at. And I hate to tell you this, but when the boss and I had lunch, he... Uh, he told me that, uh, well, he told me that he loved me. <laughs> um, and I was trying to play it off at the time that I was fired or something like that. Um, so, yeah, so that's gone. Um, Lori Lee and I tonight went to Michael's, and that clip is gone. I just got through filming Phoenix sleeping in bed because today is his four month um, birthday kind of his his four months in the world today on the 13th and for those of you who have been watching since he was born on the 13th of December um, you guys know that so that clip is also gone so and, and I'm freaking tired right now it's already midnight it's been an exhausting two days um, and I'm not going to go into details but you know things have been happening um, so it's just uh, it's just life right now and then I go and there's no footage on the camera and I'm like oh, really oh my gosh see it just froze so I'm not sure if this is the camera or the memory so I'm using my cell phone right now if you couldn't tell the video uh, anyway guys uh, here's the rest of the vlog there's hardly anything here but um love you guys thanks for watching so it is uber late right now, guys. I was sitting here toying with the fact, it's like, well, should I do the contest results real quick? Or should I just end the vlog and do like COC and Facebook question of the day tomorrow? And then it'd be like, well, then tomorrow's vlog would have like double that stuff in it. So I'm like, I don't know what to do. <sighs> wow. So I'll yawn to begin with. And then we'll do the Facebook question of the day for today, and then we'll do COC for today, and then we'll move on, and whatever tomorrow brings, we will do that tomorrow. How does that sound? Does that sound like a plan? <gasps> Alrighty then. Facebook question of the day for the 11th. Witches. Ugly and scary, or beautiful and delightful? Wolfsbane Hollow said, Yes, all the above, because if they are ugly... They can morph to beautiful with their magic, and because that beauty can hide their true intentions, they are, therefore, terrifyingly scary. Very well said. Bravo. Bravo. I want to try and do this, like, unedited COC tonight. Oh, cock. That's what we're doing. Commenting on comments. Pumpkin Patch 1993. You should put a dead tree in the front yard of the birdhouse. Very good idea. I think I actually kind of like that. Put it like right here in the corner or something like that. That'd be kind of cool. Columbia Manor Haunted House. I love the birdhouse. It's almost complete. <sighs> One down. Simple Plan Rocks 22. I wonder if a crow would want to inhabit that birdhouse. Well, I don't know. Why don't you ask him? Do you want to inhabit that birdhouse? Caw, yes, but it's too small. I can only sleep on top of it. Caw, caw. Awoken Nightmare. The birdhouse is great. Do you think you'll ever want to make more again? Maybe. Maybe in like the winter time. You know, for like a winter project. Matthew Halloween Haunt. I like the Haunted Mansion. How did you put the popsicle sticks on the wood board? Very easy. Just everything's hot glued. And you, oh, you guys can see that. There you go. Oh, wait. Let me get back here and let me do it this way because I have to do it this way here because it's just like lame like that. But anyway, yes. Hot glue. Not pretty. I did it haphazardly because it's supposed to look that way. And you guys know me. I'm pretty particular. So, yes, I purposely just threw the fence up, literally. Haunt Guy 311, the birdhouse is looking awesome. It's like Michael's Spooky Town collection only for birds. Kind of like that. Viva Todd Vegas. 
And this is a serious question. I'm like, wow, I have a serious question for you, hence me saying serious question. What do you feel are the payoffs for doing all these vlogs? You obviously spend a lot of time recording, editing, and posting them. them. I'm wondering what you see as the biggest payoffs for all that effort. Is it worth it? Don't get me wrong, I'm a fan, but I wonder what motivates you to put all the time, put in all the time and effort. It's multifold. When I first started doing the vlogs, I just wanted to show people kind of like what I was doing, and it was just, you know, haunters sharing with other haunters. And, you know, I, I'm still doing that, but now that it's progressed and, uh, you know, we're basically starting to round out our second year um, continuous vlogs for the same reason why I do a haunted house because it makes memories for everybody now that I've got like a larger audience not not on a daily level but you know on on the haunt vids the scare videos uh, showing other people that are not haunters trying to bring them in and show the creativity and the side of what we do so that maybe there's a little bit more understanding and respect for haunters and Halloween and just kind of getting the words out or the word out. And Todd goes on to say, watching the video from a few days ago and someone mentioned having Keith on the screen for we've got a haunt. And then he said, those were the days. So sad. I know. Times change and you got to roll with it. Halloween props forever. Hey Troy, what website did you use to make the Hellmouth pens? I want to make some and have them at my haunt. I want to order a 35 pack. You can't order a 35 pack. Um, the lowest quantity I believe was 75 on the pens. Um, I, I could be mistaken, but it was, um, someone else asked me what it was and I can't remember. I think it was like custom mugs dot com or something like that i'm i'm gonna have to go and take a look and find out mr trav 272 hey troy how much did it cost you to make your hellmouth website online i created the website and the website runs about 15 bucks a month um and it's through uh yahoo that's all i gotta say about that curless 99 what about the scary burger king update of the day i didn't do it yesterday but i did it today fuses are fun nice intro thank you Telling 35, this is a response to day 881. Yeah, Keith, we can still be friends, but you are a sick perv. You guys don't. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you guys don't know Keith like I do. And Telling 35 also says, relating to what some people said on COC, I was going to say Sad Panda because it's only five props. And it escapes me what was only five props. And I'm very tired right now, so you'll have to forgive me. GK Eagles 10. Troy just did the Puyallup Walmart. Yep, yes I did. And where we live, uh, do the Puyallup means do the Puyallup Fair, and he was saying Walmart, so do the Puyallup Walmart. That's where that came from. Tony Armenta, milestone, actual short vlog. And today's vlog was also short until I hit COC. So anyway, guys, happy haunting. Get some rest. <sighs> we'll, see you um, we'll see you tomorrow. Oh, God, that really just happened. <laughs> I shinned myself. That sucks. Owie.